Yeah, my, my, well, I don't really have a trio. I have a, sort of a rotating cast of people that I like to play with. And so almost every gig I do is with slightly different personnel, or every record I do is with slightly different personnel. If you look at my records on Palmetto, the first trio record was with Ben Allison and Jeff, no, Ben Allison and, uh, and Matt Wilson. And then the next one, I met this incredible bass player, Masa Kamaguchi. And I love playing with him. So one day I said, I'm gonna call Paul Motion. And so we met at the studio. Masa and Paul had never met. And we made a record in three and a half hours with no rehearsal, no nothing. And I love that record, but that band never played a gig because Masa then moved to Barcelona and now Paul's gone. And so the next record, I use Masa again, but I use Jeff Hirschfield on drums, you know? And then, uh, you know, the last record, the last record I did with, with, was a quartet. With, oh, oh, no, there was another trio record with Matt Wilson, now he's back, and Jay Anderson. And then my quartet record, I use Lewis Nash on drums and I use Jay. So I just like to keep it changing up. I don't like to keep anything. I was involved with this, this thing called the Jazz Composers Collective for many years. And we played a lot with each other in different bands, but with a lot of the same personnel. So in a way, I felt like I was married to that. Well, in a marriage, you can't be promiscuous. But outside the marriage, now the marriage is over. Collective is, you know, it's done. So now I can be as promiscuous as I want to be, musically, you know. So that's a beautiful thing. I mean, there's so many people out here. I don't want to limit myself that way. I love to play solo. Um, it's something that I did a lot when I came to New York. The first work I had there was solo. It was not under good circumstances, but it was six hours a night, sometimes six nights a week, and that gig lasted for five years. So I learned a lot of music. That's where I learned Herbie Nichols' music. I uh, you know, learned a lot of Monk, a lot of Ellington, a lot of Standards, a lot of different things. So I like to mix all that in. I love Annette Peacock's music. I may play tune of, or two of hers tomorrow, or Carla Blay, or, so I love composers, and I love, I love playing solo because I have some, some concepts about time that don't work so well always with other musicians. Just stretching the time, or things that you can do in a solo context that it's much more difficult to do in a trio context. So we'll play tomorrow, and if nobody throws anything at me, I'll, I'll find a measure of success in that. So I just say my name? And are we ready to go now? Yeah. We're ready? And then clap, just so you... Okay. I'm Frank Kimbrough.